Anand sir, thank you so much for talking to OEM Update. It's good to see you here in Motortech. Can you please tell me what are your expectations and what you are going to talk here at Motortech? Uh, yeah, thank you, Prasad. Uh, my name is Ambar Singh, and I'm here for uh, the Plastic Omnium Company. And the, my topic is just uh, introduce about the labor uh, challenges at the industrial trades here. So just came to here to uh, speak uh, on this topic. Yeah. So when we talk about the labor challenges or manpower, uh, say challenges, one of the important aspect comes in, in uh, skilled manpower availability as well as upskilling. Yeah. How you look at it in addressing uh, corporates are addressing here in India presently? Uh, yeah, currently skill challenges already uh, here. You are right. So uh, government and uh, that uh, AC is there to uh, work with the companies. So we are getting support from uh, these types of organizations. Some uh, 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 other organization NGOs are there to make uh, the people upgrade and uh, skilled here. So from that we are getting. But still, the challenge is there. Especially, uh, you must be addressing about work floor uh, dignity. Uh, we, when we look at uh, blue collar job and white collar job, still do we still have that dogma when it when we approach uh, manufacturing space? It's a good uh, question. For the manufacturing setups, we are we have to do something for the for the labor who is just upgrading right now, and uh, few companies are doing uh, for this. So it is the it is the uh, corporate res responsibility also to upgrade uh, to give the uh, 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 some platforms to get the upgrade for the labor uh, here in the Gujarat or somewhere uh, where the industries are there. There is always a you know a breakman challenge like what you said the availability of labor as well as the demand. When you see uh, presently even now demand is higher than the availability of skilled manpower. So will that lead to uh, an increase in per hour pay for this uh, profession? Uh, yeah, uh, currently many companies are coming here and uh, the companies are planning to come here. Uh, few companies are giving the supplies to the warehouse. So they are also just planning to come here. New, uh, we have the announcement through the Vibrant Gujarat also. So new companies also, new setups also, our OEMs also are coming here. So definitely uh, there is a huge uh, requirement for the skill and the labor, skilled labor. Companies are planning uh, uh, to uh, connect like uh, IC uh, like of organization and uh, uh, other than they are planning to get the uh, skilled labor from other uh, part of the country like uh, from uh, uh, Haryana and uh, from uh, other states so that will be required uh, for a few days but after the few time uh, the skill will definitely will be there because many organizations are working over it and we can expect a pay rise in this yes for per hour uh, you know uh, what get paid currently is in on industrial uh, international standards it's quite low uh yes uh, in, in, the, in the latest uh, one year so uh, uh, the government also increased the wages here in the gujarat so it's a, a good hike but uh, still it is going continue so that is also going on so we are hopeful about it. yeah Sure. Thanks so much, sir, for talking to OEM Update.